first time I read about John Brown was when I was about 14 years of age. His whole life story had just utterly fascinated me because of the kind of man he was, the absolutely fantastic determination to abolish slavery. In back of our house, over the rim of the hill, is a grave uh, where one of John Brown's sons is buried. To live at the foot of this grave is uh, many, many thousands and thousands of miles distance in time and in living from living in a ghetto in Chicago. When it finally happened that two beautiful kids came into our life, oh man, it was such a glorious feeling. It's a legacy, the legacy of, uh, of knowing that so much of what's inside you, so much of yourself is going to be engendered in another person that's going to go on. But man, that's a sense of history there, that of, of, of future history. I think a man without a history is nothing. Being an artist, it's a lonely activity. You dig down in yourself. You try to draw out something that's important, meaning for, for you. Something out of a whole vast bulk of ideas. Your total existence. I used as symbols a, or as images uh, black people that symbolically represent the masses of black people in this country. I use this image to talk about the condition of man, the injustices of society. And yet, when I use this image, I'm not addressing myself solely to the black people. Hopefully that I'm creating an image that cries for justice for all oppressed peoples. I dig teaching so much. For me, it's where it's at for a great part of uh, my daily existence. I find that youth turns me on. They're thinking, they're feeling, they're reacting in a very positive, constructive way. In 400 years, I came from a land that did not know how to read English, did not know the Christian customs, and I'm sitting here in Otis with you today. Man, that's a damn good showing. These people who have never been but defeated, they have maintained a strength, they have magnificent moral courage, a beautiful spirit that has caused them to survive. This has been the source of, the basic source of my inspiration for not only my works, but for my being for my sense of pride, for my own personal dignity. You know, I've thought about it a lot, how, why, how I do these things, how do I think, how does an artist think, because it's a fascinating uh, uh, thing, you know, because you get to say, why, why am I so goddamn unique? Do you need something outside yourself to, to, to get this thing going, to say, well, why don't you be an artist? I can see where somebody could get wrapped up in a moon, reflection of a moon on a bl uh, and paint on black velvet, the reflection of the moon on the water, and, uh, and a palm tree coming off. I wouldn't question that person could conv probably convince me that this is a very meaningful thing to him, and he gets turned on by the moon reflecting on the water. Uh, but uh, I, I could still say that as far as he's convincing me through the work itself, man, that cat ain't doing a damn thing. It's like a cat marrying a chick, because she's pretty. She got all the features, all the facial structures of the so-called ideal concept of beauty. He marries her for that service thing. And could care less what's inside. And isn't that the tragedy, not only in art, but in, I mean, I'm white, Mr. White. <laughs> Do you black guys see me? Until we really dig the essence of each other, there'll always be friction and fights between us. I fight with you to understand you. And maybe in understanding you, I'll understand a little bit more about myself. And if, if my people had have had a little bit more gut and your people had a little bit more love, maybe we'd be wherever it is we're supposed to be as human beings. You and I can do it. My father won't do it for you. 
Your father won't do it for me. So I teach. That's why I look forward to each day. I never get up in the morning and say, oh my God, I got to face another day. I get up in the morning and I say, what a thrill it is to live. What new beauty is going to come into my life today? What new hope for man is going to come today?